Hello everyone, Mocha Bear here. Welcome back to Mocha Bear's Gaming Den, and welcome back to Boulder's Gate 3. Uh, as you can see, I am joined again by Mystic Naz. Hello, sir. Hello. And we are going to try to continue with the story. I'm going to put my gear back on. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah, we gotta do that. Yes. Um... Yeah, all right so we're ready to exit camp yep leave camp all right leave camp uh, we're off to a great start for the game itself but not for logging on discord wanted to be a pain in the butt right away wouldn't let me kept giving me the rtc connecting and the no route thing over despite resetting the router and my computer twice but we are in uh right, so this is we we had just came out of the dungeon yeah so, okay this way watch out for the roots that might be worth a look what, what? oh oh dirt mound that's new my passive perception picked that up oh well, that's new i haven't found that yet yay i found a secret um, scroll of detect thoughts and a scroll of cloud fog. I'll send those to Gale. Okay. Speaking of which, he's not following you. Now he is. I fixed it. <laughs> okay. Was he? Oh, was um, he just not moving? He was not grouped up with me. Ah. Uh... Speaking of which, I've figured out the short key to break the queue. Uh, break the. Um. Uh, break your group up. If you hit G, it'll break the group up. If you hit G again, it'll bring the group back together. Ah, okay. So I if you see. want Starion to do something sneaky, since you kind of can't go after him being a cleric. I could. I just need to not be wearing heavy armor, which gives me disadvantage. <laughs> so, like a breastplate. So, um... We are what? Level two? Yes. Level two, correct. So, so we're almost level three. We'll probably be level three after this next um, next little thing. Yay. Um, do we want to rescue the Githyanki? Oh, yeah. Yes, please. All right. So we're going to go up this way. Up this way. This is the one that was with us earlier? Yep. It's Lizel. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Right, up this way, right over here. Whee! Oh, over here. Oh, I hear. Nope. Up this way. Where the teeth, the two t uh, teethlings are. Oh, I see. I was looking for where the talking was. Yep, the teethlings. Go talk to the teethlings. Zoru was right. Yellow is a toad, twice as ugly. The thing's Yellow dangerous. Toad and twice <laughs> Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you? Oh, a guess. Why can't I be that Just actual stealthy? In response to the prisoner's white hot stare, her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Don't worry. This creature's so, dangerous. You know what's funny? I did the persuasion check as my paladin, mm -hmm. and they drop her down, and we go to attack her, and then she's like, kill the tiefling, save me, and I decided to do that, and it broke my paladin oath. Oh. And Oathbreaker is a thing mm. in um, this, uh, in Baldur's Gate 3. Nice. You never speak of them aloud. I know what grows inside you, and I know of a cure. I said I'll get rid of them one way or another. I don't want to attack them. Oh, deception. deception yeah, uh, deception there we go. Attack them. I was say, Come on. That way you can roll eight or five. Oh, thank God. He's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. You didn't hear it. Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. OK. 
Come on now. Come on. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Yes. So much better than last time. Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound, she can mend it. And be careful. There are goblin traps everywhere. Nymessa, come. Enough gawking. Now there's a thing Gets me in down. Here, and I don't want to say anything about it until it's revealed. Because <clears throat> I didn't know these were a thing. Mm. Um, I don't know the quickest way to get her down. Observe. I was going to say, is it the shoot? Ooh, dragon egg mushroom. Oh, I was going to say, I could have just shot with a crossbow, probably. Auspicious. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. Um, you will you join. I'll send her to the party, or I'll send her to the camp, because we can't put her in our party right now. Okay. You would sacrifice yourself to Geich. Such tiring mediocrity. Then fine. <laughs> Wait at my camp. Very well. Speak there. But heed my word. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this <laughs> Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. I must interrogate this Zoru. Our very lives depend on it. I will targets. be at your camp. Do not keep me waiting. La 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 Ooh, a short bow. Oh, there's a short bow near. Oh, they probably did that so if nobody had something, they could shoot her down with it. Mm hmm. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, Ooh. you can go either way. I'm going to go up here. Damaged snare trap. Check it out. Thought B. We're not going to go that just yet. So, both ways wrap around um, to a gate down there. I'm going to go up on the cliff, though. Okay. Um, You'll understand in a second. Um, <laughs> yeah, I moved my camera as far as I can. So, I see the gate and I can hear yelling. Yep. So, we're going to head towards the gate. All right, so should I go up? Should I go up top too? Um, the only reason I'm going up here is because of Gale. Oh, okay. Ah, I see them now. They, it's oh. saving. Okay. We're going. All right. Well, I guess I'll go down there. Here I come, people. Open the bloody gate. Oh, come. never mind. Nobody gets in. Zevlor's orders. Zevlor's orders. That pack orders. of goblins will be on us any second. What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let goblins here? Where is the druid? Please! There's no time! Ooh, a warg. By the nine hells! Open the gate! <clears throat> You're gonna see a lot of enemies. You're like, oh. <laughs> Ooh, goblins that have somewhat decent aim. No! They worship something called the absolute. Shit! Form a line. A straight line, a zigzag. Whoa, damn. Damnable rope. Here comes Will. <laughs> Provoke the, the blade. Mm. What he just did there was Such actually um, Eldritch Blast. That's what I thought. Okay. Damn. Where am I? I am oh, okay. I'm not that far in initiative. <laughs> I am. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> Damn, dude. Oh, no. Don't man, don't. Historian. There's a goblin right here with us. What the hell? I don't so leave them be. I got a plan with Gale. Oh, because I was going to use. Want to do it. He doesn't say uh, Dorian's got sneak attack on it. Well, what I was going to tell you is you can um, 
you can thunder blast them off the ledge. Problem is, you're right next to me, and you'll get hit too. Well, that's the thing. Gale is an evocation wizard. Mm. He can thunder blast without killing people. Okay. <laughs> well, then. If you want to start hitting, because there's the goblin brawler down there that's at four life, so you could probably sacred flame him. Well, this is a Starian's turn right now. Oh, you you could probably hit him with the bow. Yeah, I was looking. We got a 70% chance, a 75% on. That's a disadvantage. Ah, because it'd have me right next to that goblin. So, it's yeah, I'll goblins. go ahead and hit this uh, bugbear down there. Yeah, those two goblins don't go until the tail ends, so they're okay. Okay. Yeah, and the bugbear goes next, so yeah, I'll go ahead and hit him. With pleasure. Damn, I hardly did anything. Was uh, that sneak attack or regular attack? Uh, that was regular. I didn't have the option for sneak attack. Oh yeah, you're not an assassin. Yeah. Uh, so let me go ahead and move Starion out of the way. Oh, the, uh, these guys aren't going to go against them. So we're okay right now. Uh, let's see here. I have okay. one spell slot. So I'm going to Sacred Flame. For oh, three damage. Really? Wow. Really? What kind of crap is that? Oh, that'll knock me prone. Are you kidding me? Oh, Try no. to push him. See this push guy him. right in front of me? Yeah, see if you can push him. Okay. Uh, uh, no. Push. Shove. There we go. Good job. <laughs> Did one damage. <laughs> Yeah, but now she gotta climb all the way back up here. I was gonna say, is he gonna blow the horn? And we all get temp, uh, eight temporary hit points. Oh, I see that now. You're welcome. I damaged him earlier. I could have just sneak attacked the goblin that was standing next where I am now. Yeah, but I, 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 I wanted to teach you something about like the combat in this game. The combat in this game, you definitely want to think strategically. Mm. It's like playing D and D all over again. It really is. Just gonna end with you. Let me pull you up here. <clears throat> Still have the goblin right. at the bottom. So, what do you think? Lightning, fire, ice, acid, or poison? Uh, poison, because the ice knife would be great. Problem is, there's allies oh, no, within range of those enemies. Ah, okay. And he's still dazed. You missed! You missed! Oh! Yeah, that ain't gonna... None of that. Huh. <laughs> really? He greased us, so... Yep. Guess what's coming next? Don't use fire. Don't use fire. Uh, um, you know what? See if you can kill him. The oh. one. Yeah. Uh, let's see did, here. Did you use when you went stealth? Did you use your one thing? Well, there goes Asturian's turn. Oh, he slipped. Yeah. I was like, what happened? <laughs> He's just like, doo, doo, doo. whoop. Yep. Mm. Really? Okay, I thought he survived. 
How can your how does your cleric do more damage with a ranged weapon than our rogue? Nonsense, that's how. Uh I'm gonna dip it in the grease. No. Uh <laughs> no, I can't. It's difficult terrain. Not enough movement to get there. Yeah, that's right, because I used half my movement to stand up. So... Uh, there's nothing really else I can do. Ah, uh, I'm going to try to move. Hey, I didn't fall. Hey, we leveled up. Tarion's just laying there in the grease. Throw your sword! Disrespect. Speaking of which, I'm going to turn my ceiling fan off. Oh, the poor walk. Uh -huh. Almost hit my neck rod. Oh, there we go. Poppy! All right. That's better. Uh, let's see here. 60% on you, 45% you're at 21. Let's just go ahead and get rid of that. And then... Let's have some courage. Do not slip. Thank you. Ugh. Cunning action dash. Moving. Oh, he saved. Good boy. There we go. I thought that said did forty two damage. <laughs> You can still hear me, right? I'm muted. Yes. Oh, oh okay. Oh my god, it worked? He's down to two. <laughs> if only that sword was... Uh, if only that shield was vibrating. Mm. Yay! That was the last of them. Inside! All of you! More may follow! Open the gate! No, we're gonna chill out with them all. What were they well, the yeah, I'm gonna they check this body. Like Ooh! Gold. Uh, I don't want wow. his goblin bow or his bone. They closed the gate. No. It's okay. We can burn it down. More gold. Moving in. All right. So let's All see right. here. Level up. I'm gonna be a wild heart barbarian. 
Berserker Wild Magic. Oh boy. Alright, so let's check a look at spells. Um Guiding Bolt, what was this? Prayer of Healing. Oh. Cure wounds, healing word, inflict wounds. Two D eight plus three, but can we only use outside of combat? I don't know if I'll be using that. Oh, yeah, no, we're taking spiritual weapon, my guy. Ooh, spiritual weapon. Blindness, silence, hold person, calm emotions is always good. Lesser restoration is always good. I'm at I'm at a toss up. Should I be a wild heart or, or wild magic? What's the wild heart do? Wild heart gets um, a bestial heart, which basically I can be a bear, eagle, a bear heart, eagle heart, elk heart, tiger heart, or wolf heart, which um, gives me special abilities when I'm raging. Oh, <laughs> that's a tough heart. One. Because wolf part, when I rage, I incite. Uh, I, I can use inciting howl, and basically gives my allies advantage on melee attacks against enemies within two meters from me. Um, tiger heart, while raging, you can use tiger's bloodlust, and you ju and your jump distance is increased by four point five meters. Jeez. Um, elk heart, I rage when I'm raging. I can use primal stampede where my movement speed is increased to 4.5. Eagle Heart, um, foes get a disadvantage on opportunity attacks against you. Okay. And I can dash, and then Bear gives me unrelenting ferocity, and I have resistance to all damage except psychic attack. Sheesh. I might... But I'm not... Uh, mm. I mean, I'm not... Not looking to be a tank. Mm -hmm. And then if I rage as a wild, like if I go wild magic, whenever I rage, a random wild magic effect happens. Mm -hmm. Ooh. He's an arcane trickster, is he? He can. You can change him to a thief or an assassin. Mm. If you click on subclass. Mm. I don't want to be a berserker. But the thing is, is if I become a wild heart barbarian, I get one of the one of the best side spells in the game. Hmm. Speak with animals. Oh, there you go. Talk to that damn squirrel. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. I'm having a really tough choice here. <laughs> I want to I want to do wild magic because I think wild magic effects are going to be a blast. But wild heart looks so good. Mhm. Mm oh. But I don't I don't know which heart I would go with. I'd either go wolf or wolf or tiger. Oh, I actually get a piercing. Ooh. Oh, I could give him find familiar. Oh, oh, is he wearing armor? I can't remember. Is Starion wearing armor? Yes, he has leather armor on. Okay, then I won't give him mage armor. Trader, ice knife, <laughs> grease. Ooh. Should I give him shield or magic missile? Mm. Oh, I get a self heal. I think I'll. Uh, I think I'll give him magic missile. I can always change it later. <sighs> Yay! I'm going wolf, wolf, uh, I'm going to go wild heart, wolf heart. Nice. Barbarian. Ugh. Rotten chicken eggs. 
no, 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 no. I started this as a wild, uh, wild magic barbarian. I'm gonna finish this as a wild magic barbarian. <laughs> Ooh, a spiked shield. Oh, and it's a plus two to armor class. I'm taking that. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Gloves of power, absolute bane. On a hit with a weapon attack, possibly oh, inflict a one d four, a minus one d four penalty to the target's attack rolls and saving throws. Sleight of hand plus one. Is there a level two spell you swear by? By the way, um, in general or for my class? For wizards. Oh, level two. Mm, it's been a while. Um, what are some of them? Uh, we got Arcane Lock, mm -hmm. Blindness, Blur, Cloud of Daggers, Crown of Madness, Darkness, Dark Vision, Detect Thoughts, um, Enlarge, re uh, Reduce, Flaming Sphere, Gust of Wind, Hold Person, Invisibility, Knock, Magic Weapon, Melf's Acid Arrow, Mirror Image, Misty Step, uh, Phantasmal Force, and Ray, Ray of Feeblement, Sea Invisibility, Shatter, and Web. So, I've already picked. I've already picked Scorching Ray. That's one okay. of my go my go to. And you said Shatter was there. Yep, Shatter was okay. there. So Shatter is one. Uh, Raven Feeblement. Um, Misty Step, and the one that was after Misty, uh, um, what was the one after? Phantasmal yeah, Force. Yeah, Phantasmal Force. Those are all four really good ones to have. Misty Step is, almost every time I go with a class that gets access to it, I use it because I like to be in the middle of things, but if I need to get out of there, pff, bonus action, I'm, I'm moving 30 feet away, uh, teleporting. You know what, I think Misty Step would be a good one for him. Let's, let's remaster all my spells here. We're going to put Scorching Way, of course. We're going to put Shield. We're going to put Chromatic Orb. Um, Witch Bolt. Misty Step. And... Second Wave. Hey. I like it. the bottle it's empty Put you up here more gold rogues did morsel the, did you get the gloves off of zachary yes combine three of these to grind them into salts oh uh, oh i can make a potion of healing out of that okay so ooh, i hit journal instead of inventory uh actually let's do this look at everybody's stuff now I have a studded shield. Um, did you want a, another shield? No, I'm good. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, I'll take those gloves if you don't want them. I'll wear them. What do they do? Absolutely. Yeah, I think these would be great for you. They give us a, a plus one a sleight of hand. Uh, you want to wear them? Yep, I'll take them. Okay. Uh, well, actually, are you gonna play? Are you gonna play Asterian ranged, or are you gonna play him in your face? Uh, it depends on the situation. It'd be best to keep him ranged. Okay. Because that's the only thing I was like, since he might be, if you were gonna play him in your face, they would be better for him. But if you're gonna keep him ranged, it'll probably be better for mm -hmm. me. Okay. Do I want well, to use? Well, actually. Hmm. A weapon, um, a bow would be a weapon, right? Uh, yeah, it's, it's a weapon. Actually, it's a weapon this attack. might work well with him because it says uh, on a hit with a weapon attack. Mm -hmm. Not a melee attack, a weapon attack. Yeah. So they might be better off for him. So okay. Because the uh, they give the plus one to, um, you can equip them. I can't equip them. <laughs> oh, okay. But there they would go. go better. They would go better with him because it gives him the plus, gives him an extra plus one to his sleight of hand. Plus he has that ability, which would work better with his bow because he can afflict bane every time he attacks with his bow. Mm, okay. 
Um, did you want this long sword I picked up? Uh, well, I threw it. I mean, you can keep it. Oh, okay. That's... Oh, that's why it was there. It was in the ward. Yeah, I threw it. Okay. <laughs> um... I started. I started thinking like a barbarian. I'm like, I can't reach them. What can I throw at them? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah, I want to sell some stuff. Well, come on in. All right. I'm on my this way. Is our, this is our first. This is our first uh, settlement. Yay! Look, man! I'm gonna eliminate every one of you. Try me. We technically could if you wanted to. <laughs> no, I'm not going to. Ah. <laughs> you want to fight a bunch of? You want to fight a bunch? A bunch of druids? Go ahead. <laughs> no, thank you. I'll let you lead. Children ahead. here, you fool! Oh, he already started it. Never mind. <laughs> I, I was I was looking ahead and then you moving myself, not paying attention. And you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! Why do I have that smug look on my face? Before the horse shows up. Tell that to the dead at the gate. Shut their horns! I'd be lying dead next to the goblins if you'd stalled any longer. My duty is to this camp. Oh, God forbid you risk your precious tail. But I shouldn't be surprised. Foul bloods ain't known for courage. Yo. You see the tiefling's oh. jaw. You want a little. Clenched. You want a little. <gasps> He's about I succeeded on insight. Good shit. It was a passive insight. Stand back and watch. Well, Melee well, attack. Insight is wisdom, isn't it? Yeah. Wisdom is, is supposed to be my main thing. I was about to say that, that doesn't really surprise you. I mean, it the way we it was all happening last time. It, it it's all gonna surprise me anytime I succeed. Aim a blow at the human trying to knock him flat. Uh, no, let's try persuasion. <laughs> I was about to say, who do you agree with? Do you agree with either, or do you, do you agree with one? I'm trying to be the good guy here. Ooh, let's see. Ooh. Fourteen. Ooh. Fifteen. Son of a bitch. And we don't have. Oh, With don't a have thunk, the armored man Oof. collapses. Knock him out. Unconscious. Enough. The goblins have found us. No doubt the beasts will be back. We need to pack up and leave immediately. No, we're we're gonna we're gonna go. And they're trying to kill each other for once. You can actually go talk to him. I sh oh, oh, I was shifting my camera without realizing it. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk to the unconscious dude. No. Now I almost did. Settled. <laughs> Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlor. Well met. I should warn you. Visitors Where's Kane, by are the no way? longer welcome hmm? in this grove. Where's Kane, by the way? Whatever your business, Kane? I'd see to it quickly. Kane. Your name is. Yeah, I know your name out. isn't us. Uh, it's isn't Abel, but it's spelled oh. like that. Yeah, no, it's a ball. I hate you. <laughs> like when you said that, I was like, "Is he talking about the biblical Cain, or yes, is he, is he talking about something I'm not picking up on?" You're a cleric, and your name is Abel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is a ball. Uh, these goblins have there been many attacks like this. Uh, there have been several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us oh, outside. I meant to tell you, drawing you them here. you'll like this. This is a little Nobody's Easter egg welcome anymore. for They've your started descent a ritual into Avernus. To cut the grove okay. off from the you know the city outside. that got pulled we into Avernus? Mm -hmm. But we'll be slaughtered yeah, these if we leave. Are from that city. We are no ah. fighters. That's why they're I've refugees. Mm. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though... I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. Really? We're messengers now. We owe you a great <laughs> debt. Shut up, Asterian. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids. If you at play the his story out, like. The Please one thing I will say about this game sense. is Before the character arcs, the character arcs 
are just like a tabletop. Like they get their in-game fantasy. First, mm. by the end. I down near die at the hands of goblins. It is then, like it, it's a almost takes its frustrations it's out of me. I'm done. <laughs> I'm so smug. I should have just left them there sleeping. Ooh, I can go open those crates. Don't be stealing things. It's not stealing if it's offering. If it's Aww. red, it's stealing. Was it red? Oh, if, if the health bar is red? No, if you hover over it. Okay. Yeah, because when I hovered over the dead tiefling, it was red on him. Okay, I see yes. it. I see what you're talking about. I'm picking up what red, you're putting down. It's red you're stealing, so make sure nobody sees you. <laughs> Just like in Fable. Um, that's the, that guy right there is, um, Aaron, or Aaron, a a -Ron. Oh, right here. Yeah, he's, he's a merchant, and then there is two more merchants down the way. I'm gonna mute myself, by the way. Okay. Hey, a Ron, I got crap to sell. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met. And thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. We druids will be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well, may Sylvanas guard them. As they continue their travels. <laughs> as I said, it's a drastic measure. But the survival of the Grove is paramount. There just aren't enough supplies to support everyone. I pray no goblin arrow has grazed you. Nettie could put you to rights. She should be with the others in the inner chambers. But I doubt she'll be taking on new patients. The grove will be locked down soon. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Bits and bobs. Bobs and bits and bits and bobs. Boots and pants and boots and pants and boots and pants and boots and pants. Ooh. Boots and pants boots and pants. And boots and pants. <laughs> Roast pork. Okay, so I'm going to sell this studded shield because I'm carrying one. I'm going to come down to this other guy and sell crap while you're doing that. Okay. I'm uh, going to make sure I don't talk to anybody, anybody um, that has a story. Okay. To them. I do not want to keep the goblin scimitar. I don't need the great club. Boots and pants and boots and pants. <laughs> Uh, I can sell one of the morning stars. Oh, that's a mace, not a shovel. Okay. Uh, I will sell the quarterstaff, one of the short bows. Have a short sword. Oh. So one of the torches I has offers additional damage. Really? Yeah. It's got a, a symbol on in the top right corner, and it says it does... Because the basic torch is 1 to 4 damage, 1d4 bludgeoning. Oh, maybe because this one's lit. Because the lit torch does 2 to 8 damage. It does 1d4 bludgeoning plus 1d4 fire damage. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Um, You like Warhammer. Right. Yes, I do. Uh, simple robe. Sell this leather armor. I will sell this spiked shield. I'm down here talking to the blacksmith, and of course he doesn't have the war, the great hammer, <laughs> or the war hammer. On my other game, he does. Hmm. Um, he has a safeguard shield. What's uh, that do? It's a plus two, but also gives plus one to saving throws. Yo, how much is it? Um, 138 gold. Okay, I'm almost at 400 gold. 
Uh, ooh, silver necklace I will sell. Uh, burnished he necklace. He also has a chain shirt, chain shirt plus one for 325. Maybe a, a plus little. one chain shirt? Mm -hmm. Wow. But that's 325. Ooh, that'd be almost, <laughs> that'd be almost 100%. Well, no, it'd be about 90% roughly of what I have. I've got all these books. He's got the hunting short bow, though. That might be worth it for a Starian. Yeah. Because it gives him access to the hunter's mark. Ooh. I'm going to sell this other short bow that I'm carrying. And it, uh, basically, it gives him advantage against monstrosity type monsters. Ooh. I'm sitting here not realizing that this guy, that he has a bunch of stuff that's available. Oh my goodness. But that's 13. That's not good for me. Padded armor is 12. Uh, Ringmail armor is a 15. My AC, ah, yeah, that my AC would go down, uh, go down, cause it gives you just a straight fifteen. So that my AC would be at seventeen with that. I don't want that, but it's magical. It is magic. Mm -hmm. Spell thief, three to ten damage, arcane vehemence. Once per short rest, you regain a level one spell slot when you land a critical hit with the spell thief. Damn! Is that a, that's a bow, isn't that's it? That's a long bow. Yeah, that might actually. Oh, well, you being an arcane trickster. Yeah. Let's see what else we got here. He doesn't have any. Ha he doesn't have a hammer either. He has an axe, a hand axe. That's enchanted. Uh, what are these gloves? Gloves of missile snaring. Yeah. Ooh. Oh my goodness, that's three hundred and eighty-four gold. Yeah, I mean, there. Uh, that that's that's valid. That that's a valid price. Oh, ring of flinging. The wearer gains a one d four bonus to throw damage. Hmm. It's an uncommon. It's ninety six gold. I might have to snag that. Yeah, I was gonna say, that might be good for you. What's this, this black grove is kept okay. by Sylvanas is faithful. Uh, are there a, typically a bunch of shovels you can find lying around? I I still have one. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't. Okay, well, yes, I mean we're playing together, so as long as we've you have one, we're good. The, we've passed one. Ah, uh, well, it's too late to now. Uh, what do I, uh, I could sell a void bulb? Pull in nearby objects and creatures. Uh, do, I don't need the skulls, do I? No. Okay. You don't. So I'll sell both of them. Uh, ruby. Should I, should I sell the ruby or keep it? I mean, aren't the gems specifically for selling? I, I wasn't sure. Because I know some spells requ require diamond dust or diamonds, um, this, but uh, this game doesn't use um, reagents for spells, thankfully. Oh, that's good to know, Malachite. Uh, Illithid manuscript. What the heck is that? It's an Illithid manuscript. Yeah. I guess I can sell it. So it's worth a gold. Ooh, I have a candle. I'm gonna sell it. Uh, don't think I'll be needing the hammer. I'll hold on to it for now. Uh, I guess the books don't really do me any good, so I'd get rid of them. I guess. Mhm. Mm Cause I got quite a few of them. Divination without magic. Ooh, I keep the Harper's Notebook. Yeah, that's right outside the... That's right outside the Enclave. Okay. Um, 
I've got four javelins. I'll get I'll sell the other quarter staff that I have. Uh, I'll sell the mace. Wait a minute, wait a minute, what's Okay. Yeah, I'll sell the mace. <laughs> Keychain. Um, is this keep the acid vial? Uh, keep that because that's food. That's used for a, a elixir of bloodlust. Okay. Uh, bars inside this bulb explode on impact, making all okay, making all nearby creatures bleed for one turn. Uh, uh I have a mug. You have a mug? Yeah, I picked up a mug. Okay. You will use that mug. I got rid of it. <laughs> I sold it. Sylvanas, guide your path. All right, I'm done talking with him. Yeah, if you want to get the um, the ring from him. Ah, ah, oh god, oh god. What are you trying to do? I hit, I hit the wrong key. I was trying to move the arrows, so, and I hit the jump. Go whichever way you want. Follow. All right, did you get the ring? Oh, uh, well, yeah, I'll get, get the ring for this, dude. <laughs> it should be, like, near the bottom far right, somewhere around there. The Ring of Flinging. Oh, there it is. Ring of Flinging. Yeah, it's 100 for me. Oh. Why was it 98 for me? He likes you. Like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Uh, I believe he's a halfling. Yeah, he looks like a halfling. All right, I'm gonna go talk to these people. This is about your precious border's gate. Pels, we can't just leave. The kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Mm. Say, so I'm gonna pers I'm gonna try to persuade. You got a good chance. Oh, thank God. I was about to say, with guidance, the lowest you could roll is an eight, and the highest you could, or the lowest you could roll is a five, and the highest you could roll is an eight. And how so, many times did I fail last time? Well, Quite a bit. bit. It's the right thing to do, and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. Zerg. Fine, I'll stay too, lest you both end up with your throat slit by Goblin Blade. Thank you, Roland. Oh yeah, thank you, Roland, not me. We should have left by hey, now. Why is that one cow tinier Damn than the others? <laughs> Instead, we're just sitting here. Uh, I'm talking to the dude. Begging to be attacked. Staying is a mistake. Damnation. <laughs> Damnation. And what about us? There's every chance we've doomed ourselves by helping these people. We will end up fodder for some goblin's blade, all because Leah insists on helping every wounded fall we see. Our best chance to make it to Baldur's Gate is on our own. This place is lost. You are looking at Laroican's newest apprentice. I'll kick yes, you in the balls. That Laroican, the greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. Well, then you can leave on your own if you want. His name is known far and wide, I see. Few can match him in terms of raw power and talent. Until now, that is. In years to come, you will boast if of this meeting. If you're a wizard, you can call I can assure you. Oh, really? Hey, we meet again in Baldur's mm -hmm. Gate, my friend. Oh, I see what you're talking about now. Yeah, two cows are big and one is small. Yeah, they're tiny cow. <laughs> Go right ahead. 
I don't know what the tiny cow is, but if you have speak, if you have speak to animals, he's like, he's like, uh, like <laughs> they'll never find me. He's a I'll druid in wild shape. You think that's the case? I think that's the case. I think that's Possibility. exactly what it is. The Blade of Frontiers. I was going to say, you talk children. to him, you're standing right next to him. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart, oh, no. too. You're only talking to that guy. You ain't talking to him. Yeah, you got to talk, talk to the black dude. That looks like kind of like you. I couldn't see Go him. On. Give me a best shot. <laughs> he was moving. Not bad. Again. He forgot to turn the hair like you. <laughs> Mine's not it. braided, and the sides aren't I'm shaved like right you. now. Umi, I was thinking about doing that tonight I before I go to you bed. To be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I Does your sister you. help you with it? No, you can do I, I do it my own, and then I usually have my dad line up uh, the back of my neck and uh, the back sides of it. Oh my goodness, I'm not going to do the half-orc option, hell no. <laughs> You're not that kind of... Me, not that kind of orc. <laughs> hmm. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers, racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. Give me the great axe. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Another escapee? Thank the gods, I need all the friends I can get. That sounds so sad. That sounds so sad. I'm not gonna appear further in his mind. Mm. Who was the one? to shed our skin and become ask. a lithid, or so the stories go. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles, not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so. Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil, a threat to the living, evil incarnate. Shit. You saw her. I wish I saw her. I just heard about her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. Ooh, I succeeded on history. Advocate, a champion in the blood war between diabolical he forces had a high. and demons. I don't think it was a high DC. Let me have this, okay? <laughs> <laughs> her name is Carlac. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Illithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her, she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Yeah, I'll do this. An excellent suggestion, but your party's full up. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. What is with my facial expressions? A splendid plan. He's smiling. We'll talk more yeah, he's, he's been doing it too often. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I want to introduce you to my favorite character. Come. You need to be introduced to my favorite character. Ooh, I could have read a book. Up in the tent, there's an old lady. Go talk to her. Up in the tent. Damon, or up where they are? Oh, up, up where I am. There's an old lady in oh, the tent. That's, there's Auntie a tent Ethel. up there? Go talk to Auntie Ethel. Oh, I, I might be talking to the wrong person. Yeah, I'm talking to the wrong person. I didn't see the tent. I'm getting food. 
Look, it ain't much, but it might make all the difference. Okay. Free the only way we'll make it to Baldur's Gate is to run and run hard. I don't need healing. I'm full on health from leveling up. Sense, you'll need every bit of strength. Trust me. Okay. There we go. Uh, if it isn't the talk of the camp. It's a rare day when I see one of you lot about. Thank goodness you came along when you. Oh! <laughs> There's an awful slump to those broad shoulders of yours, Petal. Are you hurt? Cold? Feverish? Lonely? Auntie Creep. Petal will sort you out. I've lotions and I lotions knew it. galore. Lotions, uh-huh. She wants to see my half-orc goodies. Uh, let her fuss over you, really? <laughs> no. Your choice here. No. Sorry, love. I just lose the run of myself sometimes. I must say, though, you're looking mighty peaky. See? She's I trying to get my brush. clothes off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. My goodness. The wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. Sheesh. My point is, whatever <laughs> ails you, I promise I've seen worse. My, she sounds positively demented. I love it. <laughs> Let's tell her everything. What is it? Wow. What's wrong? <laughs> wow. Uh, I want to tell her, but I, I'm going to tell her. As you recount your adventure, Auntie Ethel nods along, her eyes wide. You poor pet. My heart goes out to you, truly. We've got one, guys. Kill him. I see no sign of a tentacle yet, but that could change in an instant. You need help. Serious help. And that's I not including the, the parasite. I'm here that could do it, but yes, I may have something at home. Uh... I've collected some interesting bits and bobs over the years. She's a hag. You'll have to stop by my house just <laughs> at the edge of the forest. She has those Let vibes. And tell, she's trying to get me to her, her hut, her hag. So she's trying to get these half orc goodies. I don't want to give them up. Do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. We'll let it let this play out. We'll see what happens. We can go to her house if you want. I'm not looking to spoil anything. <laughs> she wants these goodies. She um... wants some half orc goodies. <laughs> uh... Oh, that's right. I still have the slave mind and the dark mind. Uh, send those to camp for right now. We don't need them. Okay. Well, you can right click on them and send them to camp. Love that character, by the way, Auntie Ethel. Mm -hmm. okay, but she, the first the time road. I met her, she gave me off-putting vibes too. <laughs> Dying, I <laughs> like I was like, she's a little too friendly. <laughs> I'm gonna steal from her. <laughs> Waka waka. Who wants to hear the ass joke? <laughs> I guess. You want to go meet my second favorite character? Sure. Because she is just a delight. <laughs> she is such a lovely person. Is it the person over by Great the cows? Kids. Huh? Oh, it's not the person by the cows? No, it's not. No, we're, we're, we're going. We're going to go this way. Donnie? Insight failed. I saw that. But it passed for you. Did it? Yeah. Oh, what's in here? The insight was for the cow, by the way. Oh. <laughs> this guy right here. Donnie? No, we're not going to go for Donnie. <laughs> nah, 
we're gonna we're gonna head down this way. We're actually gonna head down into the the grove now. Ah. I'll let you go first. Oh, never mind. I'm a slow poke. She's a thief, hell spawn, and you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Radrashab, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <gasps> oh, he's a bear! He's a bear! Go talk to the bear. Sacred pool. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that too. Come, Magrin. Give him a See, chance. We need to. You we need you back. to get do a druid of the moon, or no, druid of the. Was what it? What? What's the circle that focuses on? Yeah, circle of the moon yeah. that focuses on shape shape shifting. Yeah, it allows you to get up to challenge rating two monsters and, or creatures. Um, you should name him Mocha. <laughs> Well, I, I am planning on making my tiefling druid of the spore at some point. Oh, that no, like you can do a druid of the spore in here. Mm-hmm. Ooh, do I want to? Nah. Why? What's so special down here? Or I'm not looking for trouble. Oh, there we no, go. and you'll find trouble all the same unless you get out of my sight. A moment, Giona. And that's a gnome. a gnome. I was gonna say oh. he's a gnome, right? I understand. Mm -hmm. You. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Yay! Go let's go talk to Korga. Quick! He's such a lovely person. Throw a spike ball at them now. There's Volo, there's Bosk. Inway. Oh, that's Volo. That's Volo Volo, by the way. That's THE Volo? That's THE Volo. I'm gonna talk to him. <laughs> I was about to say, that that's THE Volo. You were the just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. You sure? You, you don't seem that interested. My disinterest, wow. Glory. Now then. How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind. Hey, yay! With my minus one to hit to intelligence, I did good. Common variety of goblins led by a, a lasher and flanked by booyogs. Uh, give an exact description. There we go. Goblins were of a rare gem colored hue and wielded magic. Blowguns. I think. Did I read that wrong? Did that say exaggerated? No, no, you, it's Volo, man. Okay. <laughs> I was like, did that say exaggerated and I just misread it? No, it's Volo. It's how he is. Okay. Witnesses failed to notice the obvious dragon. Lost Go back and read Volo's Guide to Everything, by the way. Did the attackers rally to the absolute? But if you read like the, the excerpts and everything that are written by him, mm -hmm. he's just as freaking out there. <laughs> rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates. Uh, I don't think so. I was concentrating on not dying. Uh, sure. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious, oh, curious indeed. Dude. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! <laughs> Hold your... Uh, oh, you're you a cleric think? of Saloon? Yeah. Oh, I'd imagine him quite displeased. Since their change in allegiance, these Since the goddess that I actually based my character off of isn't in this. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. Got us, you. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, um, in fact. She's like from 3.5 and 4th edition, I think. A, a Drardi wow. or something like that. She's a, an elven goddess of the Fey. Of the What's Feywild. Name? She's the goddess of uh, the wind. Um, I have, I'd have to bring up Roll20 to, to get the information for him. Or for her. 
Uh, goblins aren't known for mercy. Never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? And an invisibility potion stashed in your back pocket. I hope I don't kick your back pocket and break it. Until we meet again. Your butt would be invisible. Well, yeah, that's that's Volo. Sheesh. Volo, the Volo. <laughs> oh, there's an antidote, and it's not red. I smell the drama amongst these <laughs> I got an antidote. So. In the, to talk with me, talk with uh, Miss Kaga, you go in there. Okay, to the stone door. Yep. No, oh, I want to. I want. I want a pet tusk. She's, she's such a lovely person. Uh huh. I I sense exaggeration and sarcasm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Kaga. Enjoy this. Yes, Kaga. Oh my Enjoy goodness. this. I apologize, everyone who's watching this. It's a snake! Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Rath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. See, and she's I such will a lovely cast person. out every stranger. <laughs> Gail's hat. <laughs> oh my god. It didn't help with his face either, did it? No, it didn't. Uh, poison? What's this girl's actual crime? Girl, you mean parasite? I will kick you she in your inverted food, balls, ma'am. Drinks ma our water, <laughs> then steals our most holy idol in thanks. <laughs> Rath, See, it's, lock she's her such up. a delight. She Lovely remains person. here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely, do it. Don't Jewish share his harmony. Jailing the girl disrupts nature's balance. Uh, release her. I'll see that she stays out of trouble. Ooh, I could try to detect thoughts. No. Uh, prepare to attack. Oh, do I want to do nature or persuasion? Nature, you get a neg one. Persuasion, you get a plus one. Yeah, that's right. Thank you. I was like, where is that? I get a plus three for detect thoughts. Yeah, because it's wisdom. Yeah, I'm going to try it. Oh, come on. I don't get to see it. It's a private moment. I, I, I got a seven. Because I rolled a four. It was a 13. You oh. intrude on the circle. You intrude on my mind. I should have tried the persuasion. That outsiders must never the snake's hiss of approval reveals its intentions. Should the child struggle, it is poised to strike. Uh, holy shit. I have Ooh, advantage on intimidation. You get advantage. I got advantage, plus one for charisma, my guidance, and then plus two from intimidation proficiency. Holy shit. Uh, yeah. You're a half orc. You all uh, you get proficiency to intimidation because you're a half. -orc. That's right. All right, I'm gonna try it. Holy shit! You get it, man. Yeah. Oh my god. What? I rolled. Uh, I rolled double fours. Oh my god! I just barely got it. The difficulty was a ten. My proficiency and my guidance got me exactly ten. It is as you say. I almost failed that with a. To me. With a natural four. That was so Out messed up. Thief. My grace has its So there is, if you mess you, that Koga. up, that girl Most will die. Will I believe it. Here. Keep his name off your tongue. Lest Tila pierce it. I'm gonna I'm gonna roast Tila if you don't stop. She is such a lovely person. I hate her. I'm a, I'm a, <laughs> I'm gonna kill her. Oh, then you'll love this part. Come with me. I'm gonna talk to the rats. We don't have talk to. We don't have animal. I don't need it to talk to them. I only need it if I want to hear what they have to say. So, this bookshelf right here, mm -hmm. this bookshelf over here, I'm standing in front of. Okay. There's a ledge. I can see a chest behind it. 
the, yes. Take Asterion, go open that chest. Okay. One step at a time. Uh, and since you're going to be behind there, you don't have to worry about people seeing you. Okay. Uh, right click to lock back. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Let's crack it, open. it should be a very easy roll. And I'm giving him uh, guidance, so yeah. It's a DC 10 with a natural 18. So with all the bonuses he gets and my guidance, he's rolled a 30. Now read your hands the letter. To yourself. You're being watched. What? Even though he's back there, he's be being watched. Oh, I see them. But they could see you. That's the thing. Yeah, they could see. That's what I'm saying. That they could see a staring. Okay, hit C. Just like that. Oh. Okay. Is it red? Yep. Is it red? It's red. Okay, hold on. Okay, he's he's moving. He's moving. He's moving. He's moving. Yep. Alright. Go. Take all. Nice and easy. There we go. Alright, so let's see what he took. He took a Malachite. Uh let me just take all the stuff that's important. The letters the important thing. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna read. Uh, what the? Oh, there you are. Read the march crisscrossing the page. Don't look scribbled so much as slash. Kind of swamp docks, tree. Meet me alone, Oladon. Okay. The book. Yep. Read. Aldorn's Canticle, the Shadow Druid's Doctrine. Unity. Okay. Yay! Gale is inspired. Yep, we get some inspiration for finding that stuff. Yay! And it gives us a little subplot we can do if you want. If not over, then through. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call her out on her bullshit. Can't do it just yet. I'm gonna think about it at least. We get, we gotta go. What we gotta do now is we gotta if you open up the map you'll see where we all oh, not here oh we, get help from healer to... Nettie. yeah you can go talk to her if you want say oh i see uh save the refugees no it's out on the real map um, oh. down where auntie Elfo ethel's tea house is mm -hmm. that's what you can also go to the druid glow or like this druid um area Mm -hmm. And you will find another note there, and that note is the note you need to confront Kaga. Okay. <gasps> a wounded bird! I see bird. you. I saw someone hit it with a Just club. give me a moment. A moment. This medication. You know, I have healing word there. and cure wounds, right? I could do it's that too. Turner. Life or death. Now. <laughs> she chooses violence. What was it you needed? <laughs> You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Why are you asking? No good way of putting this. I uh, have a tadpole in my head. Something crawled into my eye. Humor my curiosity. I'm going to tell a her. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole? <laughs> what other kinds are there? Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. I'll get help elsewhere. I, uh, but the thing is, is there are. I'll do what I can. Uh, aren't, Come, aren't the, follow isn't me. there the frog people that lay like I lay a might be able to help. They go into like your your stomach you or your chest or something. This way. They pretty much oh, yeah, like chest, chest bursters. Burster. Yeah, it's the chest bursters. The, the slads. The slads. S L A A D. You had like green, red, black, and I think blue. Maybe more. 
Ooh, a dead body. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. You're able to listen in, right? Yeah, I'm okay. listening right now. Uh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> <that's great. laughs> so you killed him and laid him out on the table naked. Seems so. Gave Master Halson a right start. She's gonna stick me with that. <laughs> I'm gonna shove this up your pee hole. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. <laughs> with the hot chick. To find out what was <laughs> you don't pay me. I'll but take this uh, swizzle stick here. And I'll shove it up your he pee hole. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. It's a war. You don't Harry. have to be here for this. Please, don't mind me. <laughs> I'll just walk. He's got it too, right. so he has to. Let's see what we can do. Don't you make it grow. <laughs> this ain't Power Rangers. Make my monster grow. Of course. Now, tell me what's been happening. <laughs> my Have name's Sharita Repulsa. Strange events. <laughs> Goddamn diabolical. <laughs> victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. Speaking How'd of How'd you Brandon pick up Rogers, the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this Prime was happening. Yeah. The first four episodes. I saw it last night and added it to my watch list. Brandon Rogers actually has a role. A flare ship? He plays Katie but Killjoy Master Halson in one was episode. Sure. Good. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. It was great. Me and Jen laughed If you transform here, we're all dead. <laughs> But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Uh, silver, I swear. I hope it. it doesn't come to that. But thank you. <laughs> Here. Now I'm gonna use this to kill. Uh, you what's know, her name? I've spent my life treating folk. Hey, Nettie gave me this this medication. Infection. She said it's for you. Then suddenly, Drink up. There's dozens of you. Make sure you save some for Maybe your snake. More. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them. Did you just open that door? Figure out what the hell no, was the door going just on. opens and closes <laughs> randomly sometimes. <laughs> you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers why. aside, you seem perfectly normal. Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms. Oh, well, it hasn't been seven days yet. Born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. Though, it's not. one of their worms mm. for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections. I'm gonna become a warlock of the of parasite. Them. Not yet. From yeah. Grim Hollow. Hard to say, but there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. So, go and get him. Oh <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. The thing is, I've sent birds to find him, but the place is rotten with goblins. None of us can even get close. He's a goblin now. You, though. You're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. How dare you? Kill Very someone awesome. carrying their parasite. The if you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can That's discover the... what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. When this game first came out? How's that sound? Oh, it's that druid? Yeah, he's oh the bear goodness. druid. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you. I hope I don't accidentally kill him. Everything to the grove. To me. I wish I could tell you what happened out there. But those adventurers were the only witnesses. And they're long gone. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. Can we pause for a and second? Master Halson didn't uh, make it back. Get the 
boys. Good luck out there. Yeah. And if things start to go bad, remember. Yeah, as soon as she finishes, I'll pause. Remember your oath. Library. Right, I'm paused. I got a notification. <sighs> I guess I don't need to pause. There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. Respect for cure. Then let's find him. Time is short. I'm back. Sorry. Oh, you're good. Yeah, I saw a note up here that I came to read when I did. It said I sent something in one of these things up here. I should take a look. So. Oh, yeah. The Mind Flayer Parasite specimen. Yeah. I don't want to draw any attention. Make sure she's not near. And then... Uh, ooh, I almost hit consume. That would have been bad. Uh, how do I inspect it? I picked it up. So... Nah, I'll, I'll leave that. I'll, I'll say that. Let it go. Uh, yeah. I have... Bottled tentacles... And have the Mind Flayer Parasite specimen. I don't want to consume it. I want to... I can't investigate it, though. There's nothing like... Oh, there we go. Examine. My goodness. It just lets me look at it. That's bull. I guess I might have done something wrong. No. You got... You, you have it. The consume thing is... It plays into another part of the story, but uh, I, don't, I don't want to jump the gun and reveal it just yet. Right on my feet. Okay. I'm on my way to you. Oops, on the way, dear. <laughs> Horror is on the way. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's get on. Now, do you? Now, I'm not trolling you on this part. Do you actually want to meet one of my favorite characters in the camp? Sure. Oops, one second. I forgot to write that so, down. What we gotta do is over here, there's an arch we can walk under. I see. And when you walk under that arch, take a right. The one up to your left? This one? Yep, yep. and take a right once you go through. Follow the road to the right. Okay. Go up the hill. And talk to her. Kick the squirrels, got it. I've seen artwork of her. Alfira. Mm -hmm. Fade away. <laughs> She's the reason I stopped my dark urge play. <laughs> well, she visits your camp if you play if you're playing the dark urge, and you kind of mindlessly massacre her in your sleep. Goodness. Uh huh. Uh, that sounded a little unpolished. No. More like butchering. Don't know why I bother. Mm -hmm. No, I'm moments away from a grisly death. At the hands of this bloody song. I can't... Nothing fits, you know? Uh, or you agony and ecstasy. Mostly agony. Oh my goodness. Uh, you so, uh, I'll see. Mm. It can't hurt. I mean, it can. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. I'm horrible. My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Had two left feet, mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her dancing beneath the stars. A huge smile on her face. 
Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble like ash. Wait. From the Evil Dead? Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. God, thank you. I didn't have to pick up the loot. Not an encouragement and gesture to her loot. Okay, I thought he was like, ask for it. That... That it's okay. That I'll be okay. And thank you. For everything. Moon... Moon reminds me of your grace. All the love I can't repay. Wait. Did you not see? <laughs> that evil grin she had before we have the music, the beautiful music. Oh, now she sounds pretty good. She's actually passing her performance check right now. I don't want like a Asterian standing behind me smiling like that. Where are these other instruments coming from? I don't see any magic happening. Enjoy the show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna push her. She's awfully close to that ledge. Stop! St they're both staring at her ass. <laughs> Where they both got the bedroom eyes. <laughs> After this, I need to check and make sure I still have my gold. Make sure I no one steal it from me. Well, I'm She's being not distracted. That kind of bard. Well, not her. I'm that kind of bard. <laughs> but see, this is why this game won Game of the Year. Mm. It's very immersive. Mm -hmm. Ball, don't you dare fall asleep standing. His chin is touching his chest right now. She's casting sleep. Run. Oh, yeah. I have a scroll of sleep. Sorry. Uh, there we go. Thanks. That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. Regular gnolls. There was so gnolls. much blood. Uh, so I can still smell it. One thing about gnolls I didn't know that this game taught me. Hmm. The chest burst out of hyenas. Oh. Wow. Yeah, I didn't know that either. <laughs> She'd yell at me for that clunky verse. And make me play till my fingers were raw. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. Finish the Weeping Dawn. For her. I've a long way to go. But thank you. I needed this. Now I'm gonna eat one of the squirrels. Ooh, folk songs. I'm gonna read it. You could 
do that? I'm gonna open this chest back here. Oh, the gilded chest. Oh, I can't open it. <laughs> Why not? It's locked. <laughs> oh, well then, you know what that means. Keep a blade close. This way. Uh, you're gonna keep going? There you go, my friend. <laughs> he rolled a natural 10, and that's what was required. He ended up with an 18. Uh, Cap of Curing. Soothing songs. When you inspire an ally using Bardic Inspiration, they also regain 1 to 6 hit points. We don't have a bard, but that could be used for fodder for Mr. For Gale. Mr. Poofy Hat. Yeah. yeah. Mr. Poofy Hat here. <laughs> Now, you can go the other way, but I'm going to tell you the other way has an encounter. It has an encounter? Mm-hmm. Ooh. Uh, will it affect us continuing the story, or...? No. Okay. It's just a, it's a little side encounter. Ooh. Ooh. I'm on me way. Oh, saving. Saving. Oh, so we would have heard her coming from if we came this way. Okay. Uh, which way? Oh, no. That's not her. Oh, the singing's not from her? That's not her. Oh, so head to the water? Yep. Oh, I could have... I, I almost went to climb down the vines. You can. Either way. Oh, that's too... Oh, I see. Who this be? Mirkon. Ugh. Shh. You ready for this Listen. fight? Nope. Have you ever fought these in an encounter? Don't you in hear the tabletop? It's Are they uh, merfolk? Peaceful. Not merfolk. Um. N not water, air. Harpies? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> Come back to shore. Just a bit of water. I only Cry, want to listen. You break the singing Just a little concentration, closer. or we will have a bad time. Oh, I see her! I see her! Oh God! You might have to blur some things. Yeah. Gonna be fine. At least she's not like One the harpy in the last there. unicorn. Oh God! Oh God! Um, let's see here. Uh, should I go, I'm gonna, ooh, should I go for a spell? We need to break her concentration, because if we don't, we're gonna be fighting, um, fighting saving throws yeah. against being a control her. Well, how can, um, Asterion help with that? She's in the back there. You just gotta hit her, and hopefully she fails her concentration check. Okay, yeah, the one with the purple from her, right? Yep. Okay. So, let's get a Asterion down here next to me. And will that reach? Nope, they're too far. Uh... Oh... I cast sleep. Smart. <laughs> smart. Smart, smart, smart. Holy shit, it worked. Holy <laughs> shit, it worked. I can't believe that. Now, cunning action dash and get your butt up here, back on the, the, the cliff. I was about to say, the water is difficult terrain. Yeah, so that's his turn. Oh, I'm so glad I moved him. She would have gone for him. I, right, I'm here at the on. end of it. Hold on. Yeah, yeah.
Light. Ooh. Protective lights. We all get plus one to armor while well, me and Gale. Yeah, as I was gonna say, you and Gale. You. I'm threatened. Oh, you get it while I'm next to you. Oh, yes, I do. Cool. Oh, excuse me. I'm gonna get Gale up here. Okay. Yeah, I'm waiting until your turn is done, and then I'm gonna do my stuff. I think on a, I'm, I don't know if I want to attack this one as in front of us. Yeah, I will. Just because if I don't kill her, then Asterion. Yeah, because if I don't kill her, then Asterion can kill her with sneak attack damage. Mm -hmm. All right. So I'm gonna dip it in water first and then hit her with a wet blade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, see. Now I could bonus action flourish. If you do enough damage with Flourish, it'll knock her out. Yeah, it's one to four damage, so... Do, 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 do. Yeah, all right. Knocked her off balance. Off balance. Yay! Means we have advantage against her. Oh, that's okay. Uh... No, you're supposed to punch her, you little bastard! <laughs> Come back! He's a kid! He needs to learn! You're flanked. Go ahead and do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Asterion, you get sneak attack, buddy. Ninety-four percent. And then. Uh, yeah. Time for a new approach. Okay, that'll be fine. Hey, she's still sleeping. Alright, we are going to reckless attack you. Uh, let me see if I can get behind her. Oh, well, yeah. Nice. She's dazed. I'll finish her off. I hope. Actually, yeah. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna use Scorching Ray. Sheesh. Uh, I. The reason I love that spell, yeah. man. Mm hmm. <laughs> love Scorching Ray. Ugh. Yay! And. Oh, she got up. She's awake. Oh, the one that was sleeping? Yep. yep. I see her. Well, luckily, it's not... Uh, she goes after Asterion. So, I'm going to move here. And... Ooh! Ah! That gives you 19. What? Your AC's at 19 when you're standing next to me. Yeah, it gives me a plus one. Ridiculous. Oh, my AC is an 18 right now. No, it's a 19. Well, I'm saying, like, without that. I know, but still. Oh, ridiculous. damn it. She. Okay, good. I didn't waste it. I almost, I almost wasted my spiritual weapon. Boy, why are you disengaging? Ain't nobody engaged with you. How dare you? Oh, Asterian saved. Okay, so I'm going to. Uh... I I saved, like, um, both of my guys saved. I think we all did. Yeah, I think we all did. Okay. So uh, we could easily kill her. So if you want to move your focus to the one across the water. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a disadvantage if I. Okay, so I'm gonna cunning action dash. To 
and then I will ranged attack her. Only did seven. Okay. It is her turn. Oh, she missed. Hey! Oh, I didn't. He's lured. Now! A ball saved. But, uh, Gale can still go, right? Yep. Okay. So then I'm gonna come... I can't do that, so... Okay. Uh... Really, do I really want to do this? Ooh. And then I'm going to spiritual weapon. Hell yeah. <laughs> Concentration broken. Opportunity. Wait, what the hell? Why isn't my try to move my spiritual weapon is not attacking? Does he not attack on your first round? It is. Uh, let me read it. Someone to play a special weapon that attacks your enemies alongside you. Oh, so that's how it works. I wasted a second level spell. I already attacked. So you should have summoned them and then attacked. Yeah, I didn't know that that was the thing. All right, Asterion. Well, you get sneak attack damage, buddy. Holy shit. He killed her in one hit. I'm going to go up here and get this one. Okay. Yes, here. Well, I wasted a second oh, you, level spell. You chose old hero background so you get inspiration from that. Yay! You have summoned a creature. My. Wonder if the gods are watching me. I'm taking her gold. I'm leaving her bone. She's got nothing. All right. Quite exhausted. Find a boy called Donnie. <clears throat> Tell him. Uh, um, I'm gonna hit a short rest. Uh, okay. Pushing on. And I'm gonna talk to Gale. I can. It actually lets me move the spiritual weapon. Breathing. Yes, it Despite does. Everything. Okay. Ah, the hell. Okay, Very good. Well. It's gone. Alright, I'm here. Was that oh, I didn't realize you were once. talking to him. To him. Nice fellow. We kept, of course, in walked the housekeeper, <laughs> screaming, touch. yelling, panic, and before Damn. you know it, fire everywhere. Anyway, I'm glad we got He's that boy out of his predicament. <laughs> Poor lad would have been harpy feed if it wasn't for you. <laughs> I love that yeah. conversation. Right. Give me one <laughs> second. Nice fellow. Kept in touch. Because that is getting annoying. It keeps telling me when someone is... Okay, now it's back behind me where it's supposed to be. That made no sense. Why is that bone uncommon? I don't know. I didn't pick it up. <laughs> <clears throat> Through the vines! Oh, no. There, there's treasure. Let's get some treasure. Right, be there in a second. Okay, there's nothing up here. Oh, there is. There's a polished dagger. Oh, that's not. That's just the tip of the iceberg, my friend. If I can find it, there we go. All right, I'm coming down. Cause we can walk through this water. 
I cast Water Walk. I was going to say, am I taking the long way around? But no, I actually climbed down the vines. I'm coming to you. Yep. Because there's a treasure chest. I see it. Yep, there's a treasure chest right there. Then, we can come over this way. Ooh. Uh... Anything good? Uh, gold. 54, I think. Damn it, Gale! That's where I was gonna jump. Then, if you have a high enough athletics, you can jump over here. I might. Target is too far. Nope. Get closer to the edge and see what happens. Target is too far. Path is interrupted. Yeah, I don't have enough. Hold on, let me now, see something. Now that I moved Gale. Let me see what my athletics is. Uh, athletics. Strength. Oh, I've got a zero to athletics. Well, uh, we got another ring. It's a ring of color spray, so we can give that to Gale to whenever he needs to use. I'll grab the journal and I'm sorry, and I'll pass that to you so you can read them. Okay. So I'm giving you the inscrutable journal and the note that says I'm sorry. All right. Followed. Lost more hair. Eric. Eligible page. And Miriam, I love Edmund. Cool. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to go fishing. Oh, you're good. Ooh. But there's stuff like that all over the place, so just keep an eye out. I found a chasm. Where's the chasm? It's, uh... How do you ping? Uh, the... It's the little star in the bottom right of your map. Like, the little shooting star. That's how you ping? Yep. Ah. Or alt right mouse button. Okay. There's a chasm right there. In the castle. No. That's a shame. Ooh, there's now the blood. Whoa. One of the harp the harpies just re died. Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> <laughs> uh I think there's double the bodies there now. For me. It looks like it, but no, there's not. We done. Yay. Random encounter. Wait. What's Wait up? Wait a second. What's up? Hold up. Oh, I see. Huh. In silence. And this I can make. <laughs> Let's dig this up. Okay, good. It's not locked. Um, ooh. Give the, uh, um, Gail's about to get a new cantrip. Oh, uh, what would you get? Shocking grasp. Hey, I, uh, Asterion has that. <clears throat> right click. Learn spell for 25 gold. One good thing about a wizard. Mm. You literally can put any spell in your... If you don't know it, you can, and you find the scroll, you can put it in your spell book. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking that I might actually start my solo play of this game and make my wizard character. I wish the Bladesinger was One that, one that became a, 
Oh, oh, that's right. Your blade. I was gonna ask your blade singer wizard. Yeah, the one who became a dragon. Yeah. Oh, I I miss that character. That was a fun character to play and make. What was he? Hmm. What uh, what was his race? A high elf. Oh, so you you can be you definitely could make him. Oh yeah, yeah. I had uh, <laughs> I had a lot of spells. I we um we did rolls for our um our stats. I ended up rolling uh, two 18s, so I had uh, maxed out um, my intelligence at level, th well, we started at level three, so I had maxed out intelligence. Man, so, if you open up the map, we got a lot of things to do. Ooh, we do. Uh... Where's fine? Well, we can talk to the girl's parents. Mm hmm. And then find Donnie is around the corner from that. Mm hmm. Because he'll let us into the. There's a group of um, orphans that are con artists. Ah. Okay. But we need to do something fun. <laughs> we get off. We need to do something fun. Don't care about okay. So we're, we can come back. Okay. We can come back. We're gonna go ahead. Let's do a long rest. Okay. Get our spell slots back. So go to the camp. Yeah. Well, hit long rest. You can oh. actually hit long rest. Where is? Okay. Yes. Or you can. I was gonna say. So we're gonna do a long rest, and we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna go on an adventure. We're at the campsite. We're gonna go on an adventure. Okay. Uh. So when you hit long rest, it brings you back to camp already? Yep. Okay. And there's a bunch of people we can talk to. Yeah. It's quite a sight. I'll talk to, I'll talk the, to the shadow hunter back here. Okay. I could take or leave your chin. Oh, why are you being like that? No. Just thinking. Reflecting on what tomorrow might bring. When we find the druid. Will he know how to bring the worm under control? Will this little adventure of ours be over? Good. I yeah, get some sleep, don't man. want you to run off just yet. Asterion, stop flirting with me. I will kick, <laughs> I will knee you in the balls. I will knee you in the bulge you have. After all. Um, He's wearing his David Bowie the, pants from Labyrinth. Surviving the crash. <laughs> Surviving everything that's followed. I'm not easily impressed by people, but you're stronger than I gave you credit for. I'm a half orc. What do you mean? I'm strong. I'm strong. <laughs> uh, uh. You have your charms more than you think. The smile on his pretty lips hey, is a touch too I had composed, insight. a bit too perfect. He may Ooh. Not be a word he says. No, it was an automatic thing. It was um, it was saying uh, pretty much. I found out that uh, Starian might not mean what he says. Oh, he lied. Mm -hmm. Vampire. Get to know. I'm gonna say, watch yourself, Starian. Oh, you're no fun. Sleep tight. I'll see you later. I'm sure. <laughs> well, that's not ominous. No, it's not. <laughs> I'll let you talk to the others. Okay. A fine evening, don't you think? The moonlight what is she wearing? On us. The Something almost like what I'm wearing underneath my clothes. Hideous. <laughs> All of it. <laughs> would that I were doing battle up there, among the tears. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Rocky bodies named after a false goddess. <gasps> Look above. <laughs> Watch the moon cross the sky. The tears follow behind it. Rocky bodies tumbling through the sea of night. One of them is my crash. Clear. Mm hmm. Your 
curiosity is to be commended. Gifts. This, this game has taught me more about gifts than in, in, in my many years Lears playing the tabletop. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, all I knew is that they and the mind flares were always at, at war with each other and their space travelers. At the Vash's command. But enough of this. Would you believe me if I told you, you she has a very heavy time. British accent? Come her voice on. actor. We oh, I'd believe it. I believe it. Hello, Will. We a tingle runs through your head and down to your feet. Ah, That's called a migraine. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made <clears throat> fast friends, it would seem. How do you feel? Hungry. Mm. <laughs> 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 Surprising is just the word, isn't it? Before the Elithid's unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair few fiends. The tadpoles weakened me, suppressed greater talents, but beyond that, I've showed no signs of turning. No nausea, no pain. Upset stomach, not even diarrhea. Hot flesh. Yeah, Pepto Bismol. <clears throat> uh, Indeed. <clears throat> Perhaps the worm's vat was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. Maybe it's because or I destroyed the, the bowl the they were all in. Are merely on holiday. So we they're could upset. conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. Dinner. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Which eye did, we it, did they put it behind, Will? <laughs> that was a question I was asking myself earlier. <laughs> if it's your bad eye, then we can just dig out the eye. Yeah, just pop the eye out real quick. <laughs> ah, there, I see. <laughs> We're, I'm going to call this guy Smithers. Smithers. <laughs> We you meet disrespect again. the god of the dead. <laughs> As predicted. You're at my camp, I what do you mean? I here in thy camp, for whenever thou hast need of my services. Yeah, I need you to go kill some people. He, not only can he respec us, he can also um, revive fallen allies. Oh, okay, good. Mm, yeah. There are many answers to that question. None are important. Then just give me the straight up fact. Ooh, I'm gonna try some clerical shit. Oh my oh. god! Can I cancel? Ooh, I can customize the dice. <gasps> Be here blue, that's beautiful. I like that. I like that. Can I cancel? <laughs> Dog, you gotta roll. Uh, of course I got a seven. Had you, had you got a? Had you got a? <gasps> I can roll again. Yeah, because we have inspiration. I have two. <gasps> I got it. You got it. Suck it, Lafleur. He has a divine aspect, yes. A reflection of death itself. Told you. Eternal. He's Jurgle. Mm. Inescapable. I shall answer no further questions in that regard. Kick him in his, his decrepit groin and run. What's his dick? <laughs> Twist it! Beyond more, oh my god, the video was stick. Oh my god, spirits akin to mine own, ensnared by the treacherous cult of the absolute, fell in its name. My last strawberry cream saver, great discontentment with their destiny for a mere pittance of coin. I might summon the worthiest among them to lend aid to thy undertaking. Most willingly, forsooth. 
Their Most passions do <laughs> run deep for what hath been wrought upon them. I speak the old English. <laughs> yeah. Should thou or any of thy compatriots perish, I thou will cleave soul to body once more. <laughs> <laughs> Because it is my calling, there is little else to explain. Don't you be so smug with me, sir. Hmm. Oh yeah, you can also hire uh, hirelings from him. Yeah, that's what he was talking about. A matter of coin. Oh my goodness. That's outrageous. You can use stereo to see. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Just so you know. Uh huh. Such is life. Outrage leading to a singular end. Okay, well, I leave. You are just a. Uh, like a ray of sunshine, aren't you? <laughs> Good night. <laughs> yes. Go to bed. All right, supply pack. Yeah, because I don't have enough extra stuff for it, I don't think. That's one, three, one, three, yeah. If you hit, I was going to say, if you hit the fuse, uh, it'll choose the best. Yeah, well, I've got a, I've got quite a, a lot of uh, camp supply packs. That works. Yeah, so. I've so got about sweet. ten of them. Where are you going? Mm-hmm. He's gonna go bite somebody. <laughs> you can actually get that ability for him. <sighs> to bite people? His vampire bite? Mm. You can get that for him. It's it unlocks after a specific um interaction though. Mm. All right. Where the? But let's. Uh, I'm gonna meet you outside. Well. Oh, did you leave hallway. camp already? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I was like, where the hell did you go? Let's. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's head on out. Okay. Thing. Goodbye, Donnie. What the hell am I taking the long way for? Well, I don't know. I'm taking the long way. Because <laughs> I was supposed to go around, and it's like, no, I'm going to go up here and go down and around. There's a rat. Yep. We can come back and do some of the stuff in here. Mm -hmm. Actually, what we should do is before we go the way I want to go, we should come over here. That's why. Where? Come down this way, head towards the gate. The gate will open up. here in this little alcove over here is the the fast travel ruin so ah. let's go ahead and grab that click on that so we have the fast travel ruin that's now. cool then where we're going there's another fast travel ruin which will allow us to travel back here without having to travel that far. Mm. Oh, Ooh. What is this? Oh, there's plenty more. You see uh, that right yeah. there? Yeah. Hey, a backpack. Goblins? We'll go in there. There's a lot of stuff we're... But I, well, I kind of oh. wanted to do something interesting before we 
Thieves Tools, tonight. Grease Bottle, and Potion of Healing. So let me throw those Thieves Tools into a Starion. But I figured let's do something fun before before we get oh before we finish tonight. Okay. So let's go this way. Actually, I know exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this. Come with me. Going down the hill. We'll oh, I see people over here. Right You're a true soul. You can't die. Please, stay with us. I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. I will drop kick you, ma'am. A ma strange symbol glows marked on their flesh. And something within you stares in response. Hmm... <laughs> Illithid wisdom. I'll go where I wish. No. He's hurt badly. An oil bear got him deep. If there's anything you can do. Oh, they're poisonous. I'm watching you. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. Oh, shit. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andric and Brenner, new recruits, yours to shepherd. Protect them. He is a true soul. Mind him. He will. He. He. Edwin. Ed, please! He's with the Absolute now. You're... You're a true soul. Edwin, our brother, he was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Hmm... Damn, that's a lot of options. Oh, uh, do you need to find a uh, liar? You out here? Mm. What? Are you? Are you testing us? Yes. A true soul like you <laughs> yes. has been chosen <laughs> yes. by the yes, of course. You speak Just with need her to make voice. sure you guys are, are <laughs> up for the task. task. If someone asks if you're a god, you say yes. And when the time comes, <laughs> the true are souls, you, a god you will rule. <laughs> No. Oh, yeah, <laughs> the like sequel. It. Ray. All zeal yes. And brains. <laughs> Ooh. Hmm. I don't know any druids. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Fine. Thank you. <laughs> uh. I'm sorry, true soul. I only repeated what I thought I knew. It seems the Absolute still has a great deal to teach me. Now tell me where the Druid is. You know. We know that all too well, sir, but the Absolute sent us here. We're looking for fugitives. Survivors from that ship that crashed farther west of here. <laughs> oh, this is awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a survivor on, of that crash. Looks like you found me. No. Uh, we don't know what they look like, but anyone who survived that crash is bound to be injured. That's enough to get us started. The Absolute wants them found. At any cost. You found one! Yeah! Um, do I want to incise a fight, or do I want to tell them to go? I'll tell him to go. I don't want to. I don't want to kill him. And, and just leave Ed. No, you can take his body I with suppose, you. I suppose he'd want us to go on, find a way to honor his sacrifice. May the absolute guide us. To hell. Now I can search his body. 
Force. Take the broken spear half, by the way. Strange power resonates within the corpse. It calls to you. I'm looking at the body all concerned. Your limbs oh yeah, you're about to. Own accord. There's something of value here. Something your mind... Holy yeah. shit! Why let its host's memories go to waste? The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you. Ooh. Strengthen you. I was toying with you. I'm gonna... Ooh. Force your mind shut. You will not be influenced by it. Yeah, I'm gonna shut it. I'm not gonna welcome that in. Hell no. Guidance! Oh, you get you. All you have to do is hope for it. Yes! Four. Oh, five or higher. I got it. I got a total of 16. Your muscles loosen. The tadpole breaks free of its deceased host. Quick, Reminds kill it! Your own again. For now. I'm not going dark side. I'm a good guy. Suck it. <laughs> okay. Oh, you you already got it. I saw you. It, it ran away. What? The parasite. Oh, really? I didn't see it. Yeah, it took off. Can you actually kill it? Yes, you can. Oh. Well, whoops. Alright. Uh, so what was on him? I didn't take everything. Oh. But I'll take it now. He has a broken spear haft that we want to keep. Oh, okay. Because we're going to come down in this cave and have some fun. Ooh. Candy. And by fun, I mean, we're going to fight something that probably could kill us. An owl bear. Oh, God. Why is there an open coffin? There's a wooden spoon. Owl bear tracks. Its nest must be nearby. Uh, into the cave. Oh, now there's a reason behind why I'm doing this. Because you want to see me die. Well, if we play our cards right, we can get a baby owl, owl bear at our camp. <gasps> I want it. <laughs> Plus, there's also over here... Oh, a pickaxe. That looks strangely familiar. I'll be right with you. I'm checking this body. Ooh, 47 gold and a heavy stone. I will leave the stone. There's a shrine over here to a certain goddess. I'm coming. Right here. Ooh. Hello. Ooh, a gilded chest. Potion of animal speaking. Don't, don't touch. Do not touch the chest until it... Ooh. Maybe I will succeed. Over there, a shrine to Saluna. <laughs> By Moon Maiden's grace. You didn't even need to roll. No, I didn't. <laughs> this chest sealed. I can feel its aura. Oh shit, I succeeded on the check. Picking that up. Oh, a scroll a scroll of detect thoughts. And a healing potion. Yeah. Take I was trying to take it, but you ran right in front of me before I could click on it. Okay, hold on. <laughs> um, you can jump over there, by the way. I'm good. Let's see here. Oh, yes, I can. And there is... Aha! Ooh! What's that? Ooh, Salunite Saluna, prayer sheet. Cool. Blessings from the moon maiden. And then here's Bearing a book. Pick it up. Chest. Pick it up. Pick up the prayer sheet. I already did. You did? Yeah. Why is it on the ground over there? Oh. What the hell? Yeah. Oh, pick up. Goodness. I'm picking the book up too. Alright. Read it in front of the chest. Okay. Inventory. Uh, read. Okay. 
prayers are answered. Oh. Salunite right, silver necklace, bloodstone, idol of Salune, and moondrop pendant. Ooh. When the wearer has 50% hit points or less, they don't provoke opportunity attacks. <gasps> Wear. <laughs> you are a cleric of Saloon, so I'm, uh, I'm not going to fight you on it. This tome describes the ancient in initiation rites. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Which I meant to give this to. I still Did remember I sell it. This guy's fucking son of a bitch. The Saluna oh, no, and Char. Damn it, Char. Think isn't Char her sister? Yes. Yeah. And um our lovely, lovely little cleric that joined us. Mm-hmm. Is a cleric of Char. Feel the ah. of its heavy footsteps before you see it. Jeez, those it. eyes. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I want it. Dominate beast. Ooh, I, oh, what's my? I actually have animal handling. Uh, so five plus five for survival, plus five for animal handling, plus one for charisma. I can puff out my chest and roar. I'm gonna try animal handling. Come on. I got a natural 18. Total of 25. The owlbear's one good eye flicks away for a moment. You follow its glance. The baby. Cub. Move to it. No, I'm gonna. I'm gonna back away slowly. Ah. Uh, I'm not. Arr, hold out your palms, you mean no harm. The owlbear stares, then sharply inhales your scent. It sits back, its eyes still fixed on you. A silent ultimatum. You can An leave ultimatum? now, or step closer, and die. I'm stepping closer. You ass! We have to kill it if we want the cop. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. She's distressed. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Asterion. Stop them. It's the wild magic. Be quick. I can speed a bolt of lightning each turn. How do I do that? Ooh, damn, I got a critical hit. Yes, you did. Uh, of course, me, Astarian, and me had to get uh, first initiative. On my way. I blame you. Don't you harm the baby! Well, I'm not harming the baby at all. Uh, uh, let's see here. Thunder Wave. Ooh, here we go. Guiding Bolt. You now have advantage. You don't have to reckless attack. Oh, <laughs> I already reckless attacked. Oh. I'm sorry! Damn. Don't you dare come to me, baby. Oh my god. Oh no. No, I don't want to kill it. It's got 29 hit points? Damn. To be fair, do you see how much the mother has? Uh, I see. Um... It's going to be zero now, but. Looks <laughs> from you to his dead mother. You monster! I didn't know that that was gonna happen. We didn't have to do that. I thought we were gonna say, oh, well, it's already dead, or it attacks us. 
Let the creature live, you ass. No! Stop it! You watch speechless as the cub begins to eat his mother. How dare you! Stop being non cute anymore! The cub has a fighting chance now. The now, the reason, the other reason we did that is because presence, there's a the cub spear half. To gorge himself so, on his dead if you take mother. the spear half and combined it with the spear shaft. Dun 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 dun! dun. We get the vision of the absolute. It is a 4 to 11. Targets that fail a dexterity saving throw. It deals an additional 2 to 12 piercing damage. Um, oh, it'll blind a target if they fail a dexterity saving throw. And if they have multiple eye sets, it does an additional 2 to 12 piercing damage. Jeez. So we're going to hold on to that. I'm going to give you the scroll to detect thoughts. And I'm going to take some of those javelins from you. If I can have some. Yeah. I know. I know. It wasn't the best uh, situation. But. You're a monster. You're hear a me monster. <laughs> um, there is. There's a body over here that actually has a set of. I took it. That's Oh, you already took it. Yeah. <laughs> While you were doing the spear thing. Ah. Uh, ooh, That's thank fine. you, Asterian. Asterian, whatever. He found a dirt mound up here. All right, I'll be right there. I'm going to his backpack real quick. I already I got it. that, too. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you get up there? I just... Oh, oh yeah, the, the cragged rocks. Uh, the backpack had um, a potion of healing... I think um, like click, four actually, if you gold? click on the dirt mound, you should be able to magic pocket the. Uh, yep. Oh. Magic pocket the shovel. Okay. Hi ho. Ooh, arrow of Ilmater. four to fourteen damage. So it does regular piercing, but then one d four necrotic. And then a smoke powder bomb. Wow, three d four plus nine force damage. Damn. But I think that should be. Okay, Koki. Let me come around. Oh, keep what's running. What's keep running. Do do do. Do do do. Do 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 do. do. We got a little bit more done. Yeah. You got more done than I would have on my own, because I would have talked to everybody at that camp. That's why I was like, all right, we got we got to do something fun. <laughs> before, we leave, before, before we call it a night. So I was like, I was going to take you to Auntie Ethel's. That's going to take too long. And I was like, owlbear, let's go deal with the owlbear. Mm, oh, uh, one second. That's four to eleven. That's four, okay. What are you doing? You. Oh, thank you. I'm a cleric. <laughs> my my party one uh on Sundays was like, you know, Bold is a cleric. He doesn't do healing. I do. Damn it, just not a lot. It's, and and only mostly to myself. Well, alrighty. Let's call it here. All right, so we're good. Oh yeah, uh, save. Save game. Yes, save our game so we uh, don't. <laughs> yeah, where we can override the campsite. Yes, saving. But all right, everyone, thank you for joining us today. Thank you, Miss Ignaz, for hopping on with me again. No problem. Oh, I hope you need to do this more. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give this video a like. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Hit the bell icon and turn all notifications to on, so all. Uh, comment down below if you enjoyed this episode, if you enjoyed the game, if you've played it before, if you've been thinking about it. If you're thinking about getting the game, why are you still watching this far? You're spoiling stuff for yourself. But also, share this video, please. So, please as always, take care of yourselves. Until next time, game on. Thank <laughs> you.